Hello everybody and welcome back to the channel. My name is the Prince of FNAF and if you're new here, please consider subscribing and also be sure to hit that notification bell. That way, you'll indeed be notified for any awesome videos like this in the future. I'm pretty sure it's obvious by now that Taz is one of my favorite Looney Tune characters right next to Foghorn Leghorn and Daffy Duck. So uh, while I was in McDonald's getting my usual root beer with some nuggets and filet -O fish and I saw this just kind of laying on the counter, I had to add it to my meal. It's the Space Jam to a New Legacy Tasmanian Devil toy. You can see Taz in there. And on the packaging, I don't know if it's actually, you can see it very well on camera, but there is kind of this kind of rough lined out uh, drawing of Taz there. You can see the Taz toy in here, and there's no special name for this toy, it's just called the Tasmanian Devil toy. If you look on the back there, you can see some of the other stuff that's on the list, and all of course the warnings and all that jazz. You can see all that's included, but uh, yeah, pretty cool. Looks very cheap, but hey, let's get this guy out of his packaging, shall we? All right, so here is the Space Jam 2 A New Legacy McDonald's toy for 2021, and it's simply just titled Tasmania Devil Toy. So let's take the basketball out and take a closer look at both of the two things, starting off with the Tasmania Devil with the Cyclone. You can see there a nice plastic image of Taz. It is pretty cool. It's made of a nice hard plastic. You don't have to worry about this uh, breaking. And you can see right there how thick it is. And then we do have this nice cyclone, which is a huge staple of Taz. And then the base of the little cyclone is got some kind of dirt or smoke coming up from the force of him doing his little twister. And then obviously we do have this little orange basketball. Now moving our way into the play feature, Taz is already sticking up. We're gonna wanna turn this, and then we're gonna try to get the basketball in there, and we failed, so we gotta do it again. And I'm sure you guys are getting how this works. I am not good at this. But you guys get the idea. You're supposed to try to get the ball in while he's moving, and just get it in there. I cheated there, but hey, you gotta get it while he's moving. So hey, it's a pretty cool toy. I'm sure it's a lot of fun for the kids. Although I'm pretty sure they would have just been happy with some kind of cat figure like we got when the original premiums came out for the first Space Jam movie at McDonald's. For comparison, here is the new 2021 McDonald's toy of Taz next to the Funko Pop and the Lego figure. Now, I really do think we should have got some kind of figure, man. I mean, they did figures for Daffy Duck, LeBron James, they did one for Lola Bunny, Bugs Bunny, and heck, they even did one for Marvin the Martian, who only had five seconds screen time. But they make this toy for Taz? I mean, don't get me wrong, it's a fun toy for a small kid to play with as you got the whole challenge of having Taz be spinning around and trying to get the basketball in there to knock him down. But still, it's kind of a silly gimmick. I still think a kid would have been way more happy with some kind of Taz figurine like we got with the old Space Jam toys. But let me know what you guys thought about this figure. It's something. I mean, I just called it a figure, but it's not. It's just a weird Taz toy. But let me know what you guys think about it in the comments below nonetheless. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Do take care.